The Ferno Model 71 is one of the most commonly used litters for cave rescue. In this three-part video, John Punches will describe how to rig the upper bridle, the lower bridle, and demonstrate patient packaging. Hi, this is John Punches, training coordinator for the National Cave Rescue Commission. We're going to do a quick little video just to remind you all how to attach the upper bridle or the short bridle to the head of the Fernal Model 71 litter. We're going to start with 11 feet or about three and a half meters of 11 millimeter or 7 16 rope. We like stuff that has a good sturdy sheath for that. We're going to find the center of that and then we're going to put in a figure eight bite with a nice short bite. We could also use a butterfly knot in that location. So there I am. I'm going to orient that so that if I think about the litter coming up over a lip, that we're going to have a nice smooth transition. We don't want to catch on that, that part where the knot traces across itself. I'm going to split the two legs neatly across, and I'm going to run them into the upper handles of my litter, coming in from the outside, from the downside, and then back through the loop that I have established there. So now we're going to tension that and make sure that we keep that attachment point centered on the head of the litter. Now at this point, I'm going to take my tails and I'm going to run them back in exactly the same direction as I had before and back through the two little ears that we've created in that process. This is going to give us two opposing clove hitches, which really cinch down on that rail and make sure that we transfer that load effectively to the entire litter. We're going to terminate these two tail ends of the the bridle together with a double fisherman's knot. So I make my first side there kind of toward the center of that. Okay, and then I'm gonna do another opposing double overhand here. There's my double fisherman's. You can see that we've tied that properly. We have the, the two X's opposing. Rotate that down, cinch in a little bit on each side, give it a little pull. Once that stretches out and loads, you can see that we're going to end up with approximately a 90 degree angle in our bridle, which is where we like to have as a starting point for it loads. When it loads, it's going to get a little bit longer, but this gives us a great starting point and allows us to attach our ropes, our rigging to the litter in a very effective manner. So again, this is the upper bridle on the Model Ferno 71 Ferno litter.